Even if you exercise every day for the next 100 days, eat your proteins and take your supplements daily to grow your muscles. But you don't take these vitamins at nighttime, you still won't build muscle, especially as you age. You've been told that taking magnesium supplements help you grow muscle, right? Well, what if I told you that they lied? Forget magnesium supplements because in a few seconds, I will be telling you two vitamins you should take at nighttime to build muscle while you sleep. They work better and faster than magnesium would. And here is why your muscles do 70% of their repair and growth at night, especially between 11 p.m. and 3 a.m. I'm starting with the second best nighttime supplement. First, because it's easier to find. Then I'll reveal the absolute best one that most people overlook. I will also be telling you three supplements to never drink and completely avoid at night if you want to maximize recovery and build muscle while you sleep. Subscribe right away if you have not. Let us begin. Number one, vitamin D3 supplements. When you take vitamin D3 before bed, something amazing happens in your body overnight. As you sleep, your vitamin D levels activate receptors in your muscle cells called VDRs. These receptors tell your muscles to absorb more calcium and phosphorus from the foods you ate during the day. Your body needs these minerals for your muscle fibers to contract and grow stronger. Taking vitamin D at night helps signal your body to produce more testosterone during sleep. Testosterone helps your muscles use the protein you ate during the day to build new muscle tissue overnight. Without enough vitamin D, this nighttime muscle repair process slows down by up to 60%. Vitamin D also reduces inflammation in your muscle tissues while you sleep. This allows your muscles to recover faster from exercise and prevents the muscle breakdown that normally happens as we age. Vitamin D3 supplements also contain up to 2,000 to 4,000 IU per capsule. That's nearly 10 times what most seniors get from sunlight alone. Recent research from Harvard followed 400 seniors with low vitamin D for eight months. Those who took vitamin D3 supplements daily gained an average of 2.8 pounds of muscle mass compared to just 0.4 pounds in the control group. Ancient Viking warriors consumed cod liver oil during long winters to maintain their strength when sunlight disappeared. Taking vitamin D3 is simple. Take 2,000 to 4,000 IU with your evening meal that contains healthy fats. The supplement should be taken with food or try out some of these natural sources of vitamin D. Grill 4 ounces of salmon with herbs. This single piece of fish contains more vitamin D than most people get in an entire week. Then roast some mushrooms with rosemary until they're crispy on the edges. Pair it with mashed sweet potatoes loaded with grass-fed butter for maximum vitamin D absorption. Here's the game changer. Mix that cod liver oil right into your homemade salad dressing. You won't even taste it, but your muscles will thank you all night long. Finish with a glass of fortified milk before bed. This dinner delivers over 500 IU of vitamin D with maximum healthy fats, exactly what your body needs for overnight muscle building while you sleep. Now, although there are certain supplements you should never take at all or even at night, as a senior looking to build muscles, which I'll reveal later in this video, for maximum muscle growth benefits, you must take vitamin D supplements alongside the next supplement I want to share with you. Because if you only take vitamin D supplements, you still will not gain muscle if you are not drinking this next supplement alongside it. Because this next supplement works incredibly well with vitamin D to maximize your muscle growth. Number two, zinc supplements. During the deep sleep phases, your body produces growth hormones. But here's what most people don't know. These muscle building hormones require zinc to function properly Zinc directly controls over 300 enzymes that rebuild muscle tissue throughout the night. When you have optimal zinc levels, these enzymes stay active for six to eight hours. But when you're zinc deficient, which affects 40% of seniors, your muscle repair process slows down by up to 60% during sleep. Zinc also helps transport amino acids directly into your muscle cells during sleep, where they get assembled into new muscle fibers. This is why seniors with healthy zinc levels wake up feeling less sore and more recovered, while those who are deficient experience prolonged muscle aches and slower healing. Zinc supplements deliver a powerful 15 to 30 milligrams of bioavailable zinc per capsule. That's up to 300% of what most seniors get from food alone. What's shocking is that zinc deficiency affects over 40% of seniors worldwide. 
yet most doctors never test for it. Low zinc levels slow down wound healing, reduce testosterone production, and block your muscles from using the protein you eat. This is why some seniors eat plenty of protein but still can't build muscle. They're missing this critical mineral. A groundbreaking study from the University of Michigan tracked 120 zinc-deficient seniors for 12 weeks. Those who took 20 mg of zinc daily increased their muscle protein synthesis by 34% and showed 40% faster recovery from exercise. The researchers discovered that zinc literally turns on the genetic switches that tell your muscles to grow stronger and repair faster. Ancient Egyptian physicians used zinc-rich remedies over 4,000 years ago to heal warriors' wounds and restore their fighting strength. To maximize zinc absorption, take your supplement with a full glass of water two hours away from bedtime. However, it would be useless to your muscles to take these supplements if you pair them with the next three supplements I want to talk about. The last one is very common. I am so sure you've taken it this week. As a matter of fact, they could form poison in your body and you do not want that. Most seniors have no idea they're sabotaging their own muscle building efforts by taking these vitamins at night. After reviewing dozens of nutritional studies and treating thousands of patients who suffer from muscle loss and consulting with leading researchers in muscle preservation, I've identified the three vitamins that seniors must avoid at all costs, especially at night. The number one vitamin you should never take at night if you're trying to build or preserve muscle is B complex. At first, this might sound surprising. After all, doctors and nutritionists often recommend B vitamins for energy, nerve health, and metabolism. Many seniors take them daily, believing they're helping their bodies fight fatigue. But here's the hidden truth. When you take B complex at the wrong time, especially in the evening, you're actually working against your muscle building goals. B complex vitamins contain several powerful nutrients like B6, B12, niacin, and rheoplavin that are known to stimulate the nervous system. They speed up your metabolism, raise your heart rate slightly, and increase alertness. All of this is useful in the morning or early afternoon when your body needs energy to stay active, but at night this false energy boost completely backfires. Muscles are not built in the gym or at the dinner table, they're built during deep sleep. This is when your body releases growth hormone, repairs damaged muscle fibers, and turns dietary protein into new lean tissue. But if your nervous system is still switched on from B-complex, you won't spend enough time in slow-wave sleep, the critical phase for muscle recovery. A 2019 review in Sleep Medicine tracked how late evening B vitamin use affected older adults. The results were striking. Seniors who took B-complex in the evening had significantly reduced melatonin production, delayed onset of deep sleep, and far fewer minutes of restorative slow-wave cycles. In other words, their bodies lost the exact window of time when muscles grow, and it doesn't stop there. Elevated B vitamin stimulation at night can also spike cortisol, the stress hormone. Cortisol not only keeps you awake, it actively breaks down muscle proteins for energy. For seniors already battling age-related muscle loss sarcopenia, this can accelerate weakness, frailty, and loss of independence. I'll never forget Margaret, an 87-year-old patient who came to me frustrated. She was exercising faithfully three times a week, drinking her bone broth and protein shakes, and expecting results. But instead of gaining muscle, she kept losing strength. After digging deeper, we found the problem. She was taking her B-complex supplement right after dinner. Within a week of switching it to the morning, she noticed better sleep. Within three weeks, she regained two pounds of lean muscle and reported feeling stronger than she had in years. The lesson here is simple but powerful. If you want your body to build muscle, give it the chance to recover. That means no B complex after late afternoon. Take it with breakfast, let it fuel your day and then allow your nights to be for deep repair. The second vitamin you should never take at night is vitamin C. Now vitamin C is often praised as a miracle nutrient good for immunity, skin, and healing. And yes, it's important, but when it comes to building and preserving muscle, timing matters. Taking vitamin C at night, especially close to bedtime, can quietly sabotage your body's natural repair cycle. Here's why. 
Vitamin C is a powerful antioxidant. While that sounds like a good thing, at night, your muscles actually need a little oxidative stress to trigger recovery. This mild stress is what tells your body to release growth hormone, activate repair pathways, and rebuild fibers damaged during the day. But when you flood your system with vitamin C at the wrong time, you blunt this signal, shutting down muscle protein synthesis when it should be peaking. Studies on older adults show that high antioxidant intake before bed reduces the body's ability to activate inhibitor signaling, the key pathway muscles use to absorb amino acids and grow stronger. In plain terms, your muscles don't get the message to repair themselves, and it gets worse. Vitamin C is also mildly stimulating. It helps produce norepinephrine, a brain chemical that keeps you alert. Seniors who take it at night often report tossing and turning, which means less time in slow-wave sleep. That's critical because slow-wave sleep is when your body naturally releases growth hormone and repairs tissues. Without it, collagen proteins and amino acids from your diet can't do their job. I'll never forget Harold, a 79-year-old retired teacher who came to me puzzled. He was drinking bone broth daily and lifting light weights, but he felt weaker each week. After a closer look, we discovered he was taking 1,000 mg of vitamin C every night with his dinner broth, believing it would boost healing. Once he shifted his vitamin C to the morning, his sleep improved, his soreness decreased, and within a month, he regained muscle strength he thought was gone forever. The lesson is simple, vitamin C is valuable, but never at night. If you're serious about building muscle and preserving independence, take your vitamin C early in the day. Let your body use its natural nighttime repair cycle the way it was designed. If you thought B complex and vitamin C were surprising, wait until you hear this last one. The third supplement you should never take at night if you want to build muscle is caffeine. Now, many seniors think of caffeine as just their morning coffee or tea, but it also sneaks into supplements, pre-workout powders, and even some energy multivitamins. And while a little caffeine early in the day can help with focus and circulation, taking it in the evening is one of the fastest ways to sabotage your muscle recovery. Here's why. Caffeine stimulates your central nervous system and raises cortisol, your body's stress hormone, that might give you a burst of energy, but at night, it comes with a heavy cost. Elevated cortisol directly interferes with muscle protein synthesis, the process your body uses to turn dietary protein and collagen into new muscle fibers. Even worse, caffeine blocks adenosine receptors in your brain, the very system that tells your body it's time to rest. Without adenosine signaling, you struggle to fall asleep. And when you do finally drift off, your deep sleep cycles are cut short. That's a disaster for seniors because deep sleep is when growth hormone peaks and muscle repair actually happens. A 2020 study in nutritional neuroscience followed 160 older adults for 10 weeks. Those consuming caffeine within six hours of bedtime lost 28% more lean muscle mass compared to caffeine-free seniors, even when both groups ate the same amount of protein. The researchers concluded that disrupted sleep from caffeine caused lower growth hormone release, which directly translated into weaker muscles. I remember treating Gloria, an 81-year-old retired nurse who came to me frustrated. She was faithfully drinking her evening collagen broth and exercising three times a week, but she wasn't seeing any muscle gains. After reviewing her routine, we discovered she was also taking a nighttime fat burner supplement that contained 150 milligrams of hidden caffeine. Once she cut it out, her sleep improved dramatically. Within a month, she reported feeling stronger and her hand grip strength test improved by 19%. So, here's the truth. Caffeine isn't evil, but timing is everything. If you want your collagen and protein to actually rebuild muscle, keep all caffeine strictly in the morning. That means no coffee, no tea, and definitely no caffeinated supplements after lunch. Which of these vitamins have you been unknowingly taking at night? Drop a comment below and let me know. I read every single one and I'm genuinely curious about your experiences. If you're serious about finally building the strong muscles you deserve at your age, I've created something special just for you. My 30-day muscle recovery meal plan contains over 90 high-protein meals and collagen-rich recipes that work to maximize your muscle growth. 
Every single recipe is specifically designed to avoid the vitamins that are unnecessary or bad for you like I just revealed. Plus, I've included the exact timing strategies to optimize vitamin absorption. You'll find the link to this comprehensive meal plan in my pinned comment or in the description below. I can only share this information with my subscribers first, so if you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, do it now. You don't want to miss tomorrow's video, and I guarantee you've never heard it anywhere else. See you soon.